Welcome. Back to Timberborn. I hope y'all are well. I turned the music up a little bit, and I also turned off the fog. Our drought's still coming in two more days. It's just started the recording, which is why that happens, which is fine. Alrighty. Yeah, it looks so much better without the fog, doesn't it? Thanks. Shout out to ST Hedgehog for that. And um, for those in the comments, it is Alt Shift Z to get to the, the console. And then it pops up on the bottom left corner and you have to click on it. I don't know if I didn't see it or what, but I don't remember. Um, So we could do have, this is just a regular drought coming. And so I think we have plenty of water for 12 beavers and um, we have plenty of food. So what I was thinking is, yeah, we're going to get, we're going to get potatoes in here eventually. Um, we probably get rid of these guys. I'm sure this is set to planting. We can't take any more carrots. They've all been eaten up. So I'm going to put all everything to building and try to get some of the stuff done that we were planning. Um, when the bad water comes, we are going to have an issue. And that issue is this entire blue, beautiful water is going to turn disgustingly red like this water and kill all the trees and all the plants and not only kill them, but it's going to make it so that the pumping of water is going to be slowed a lot because it still pumps water. See, it says pumps and filters waters for beavers to drink. Bad water contamination slows down this pumping speed. So we got to be careful about that too. Ideally, we dynamite this area here or something and, and uh, that'd be good. But I think in the meantime, we try to get everything else built up as quickly as possible. Is this guy not cutting these trees right here? Let's put a path. Um, yes. I guess down here. Um, yeah, because we want to be further away from everything. See if he should be able to reach those trees, you would think. And then let's let's get these trees cut too because we need the wood more than anything in the world right now. So cut these trees and let's go. Go. Perfect. They're getting the, the crops up. Um, I guess we don't need as many beavers because we don't have things to do. The question is, do we wait for all this to be done and get the 102, or do we start planting potatoes? And I think we start planting potatoes. How many potatoes do we need? I don't know. We're just going to start like this for now. So I don't think you need as many potatoes as you think, right? And then as the carrots get less, we'll work that out as well. All right, did they, somebody, okay, so let's go down here, see if Benny wants to come work in here. Oh, we have two, two extra jobs somewhere. Why, where? Oh, now we have one guy, okay. The job thing just is um it's slower than I am. Man, we need more we need more houses because we are running low. I thought I built all these houses backwards, wouldn't have that been hilarious? Uh we're just gonna go on the back side of this path for now. But yeah, it's gonna take us so much wood to do all everything we want to do, obviously, but But if we get that many houses, that would be good. Are they even building this? They are. So let's put this a little bit lower on the priority. Oh, it's on the lowest. Good. I clicked one of them. Okay, 
So there, there. That should get us some wood. Hopefully, that'll get us a little bit of wood while we wait for all this other stuff to grow. And here comes the drought. Good morning. Drought is here. It is a two-day drought. We no longer have power, although we are getting a little bit of power, just because the way water circles in here. It's almost enough power for this, honestly, but we don't need any more planks. We've got nine of them, and we're not building anything. I do think we open up this eventually, and maybe, maybe that's how we clear out the... I don't know. Let's just hope that we don't get any dry water events, or bad water, <laughs> dry water. Imagine dry water. We don't get any bad water events anytime soon. That would not be good. Oh look, they built that this one set of stairs there. There is wood up too. Um great, can he reach this last tree? No. Okay, so pause him. You're done. We might do uh, farms and trees up here. Depends how much water we can get. You know, how wet we can get the stuff up here. But for now, we don't need to... Let's get rid of that. Oh, look. We've got full-grown trees in here. Let's turn on this guy. He can cut those full-grown trees and we can plant oaks. I don't know what this guy's doing. He's completely give up. But it's to work days over anyway. This is going to be oak. That's oak too. Up there, do you see it? Don't want to miss anything. Don't want to miss a thing. Okay, the pine should be growing fairly quickly. It would be nice to have the the other stuff too, but wait patiently for that, I guess. There's only a day left of the drought, so... Good. No bad water. We do probably need to speed up um, what we do around here. Like, maybe start getting our techno technologicals. Uh, so the pump is... Fluid dump is 250 science. Okay, so we do just have to wait. Or get more science, but don't think we need to do that quite yet. Also, I think we can go down um, a pump. Because it's full. Let's make sure that this is oak. Okay. Maybe I need to t tell him to do some birch. Please, my friend. Do some birch so that we at least have something coming in. Yeah, we're, we're done. Done with these trees. This water turns clear. I guess they both do. So you can see through it. Ugh, looks like... That looks like lava, maybe? Like a wet... Like a wet lava or something? I don't know. Alright. They are all coming back to work. Oh, we got potatoes growing. This is going to take six days, three more days. Uh, we do want to get a good old-fashioned grill in here for grilled potatoes. And I think I'm just going to put it here. That's close enough. And then we'll put a storage a warehouse here. And that'll be potatoes. And I know we're kind of getting far away from the house, but we can put a, um, we'll put stairs here. It's from the plan from the beginning was to put stairs here so that they could walk up, get food, and then walk up back, back to their house. Oh, we have five beavers. Baby beavers coming too, by the way. So that is good news. We actually have one beaver looking for work. Uh, what do we want our one beaver looking for work to do? Um, can you just chop this one tree down there? That would be very, very 
helpful. That guy, he has nothing to do as we're waiting for waiting for trees to grow, which take nine days. But in nine days, we should have a couple of pines and maybe or we'll definitely have perch and hopefully we'll have a couple of pines. This guy, he is done. This guy, you can pause him for a second. Hold our pal there. Should stop building these for a moment because we don't have any trees again. We need to create a cross here. Time for a bridge. I don't know how much a bridge is really? It's a hundred for a one by one. We need we need to cross what three? One, two, three, four, five. That's like five, which is metal. We could do a th two threes, right? But that's 400 science, so no bridges yet. We'll get there. But as of now, no bridges yet. Okay, yeah, we've got two spare houses. Five beavers are about to grow up. We have three beavers that need work, which is great. Uh, what do we do? Well, for one... We need to get more logs. I guess we could go across here, right? Can they walk across this? It is hard to believe that there were simple times of mud and branches constructed. The only way we do is we deconstruct this. Because it's just a backside. And then we'll put a, a levee. I mean a dam. It would be good to unlock the floodgate so we could let water out of this, I guess. Why do we why do we want to do that again? Oh, because we could let the bad water out. So that it's not yeah, okay, that's a good idea. Let's put a uh, let's I'm gonna do this for temporary. And um I wanna put it on the back side. And then put a um a platform across, which is a hundred science, which we should be able to get pretty quickly. But while we wait, put, a, put, a, put this floodgate in. Which I guess we're not going to be able to do without wood. Or planks. Oh. So again, we're at the mercy of wood and planks. Wait, they have wood? Well, those are our last planks, I guess. Oh yeah, we had five of them. They brought all five. Perfect. Wait, where else can we get wood from? So, trees over here. A tree. I mean, this is desperation where we're going after one tree at a time. Maybe plant trees over here too. I know I've said that already, but over here. We shall see. Fast forward the nights, if I as, as I can remember. Remember, this is my PC and not GeForce Now, so it's a little bit different. Where I can't just play at three times speed like we could in GeForce Now, and hopefully the update comes. And uh, be able to do those kind of things. Okay. Cthulhu. Cut trees, please. Now we're going to want to get this done before the next drought. That's for darn sure. Which probably isn't... It's probably a ways off still. I would guess. Wait, here we go. We have another pine tree. And this is going to be... A birch when he's done. Really taking his time planting oaks, isn't he? But he'll get there. He will get there. Or we add another one. But I don't think we need to do all that, right? Okay, that's going to take some uh, luggage. We think we have plenty of time, though, to build this. 
Maybe we need more science people coming in. We're only getting one hour. Just don't have the... Just don't have the patience. Um, okay, we can't go get trees anywhere else until we have enough wood to get across. Uh, is that am I? Is that a correct? Oh look, there's the school that the underground mines are way over there. I haven't even looked at this map. A couple of places up there and over there we could go. That's a lot, a lot, a lot of ruins. We will need to use the um, the bad water eventually. But until then, just need wood. Just wood. Well, maybe I'll be right back while uh, we get this. Wait for this to happen. I'll BRB. Got a couple of uh, logs coming in from over here. Two logs, to be exact. I, th I think. Hopefully, they're going to the grill. Yeah, they are. But we had potatoes grow up, and um, now we're, we're still waiting for more logs. But I didn't want to be on pause forever. Mahalo, Mohanlo is uh, is doing a great job. Probably need to turn on this other pump. Maybe Fick get some more storage. Everything is is hinged, if you will, on on just getting logs. Let me put this down to a lower prior lower priority, not lowest, because this dam over here is on the lowest, because we don't have enough for the pump. But also, we need to build this platform to get across here eventually. Um, oh, there's a couple of trees over here too, which. I don't know why I keep deleting log. I shouldn't delete the, um, the logging things. The, what do they call it? Lumberjack flags. Oh, there's only a couple more that he needs to plant. Also, I want to put a path across there. Perfect. Oh, we're doing great. We have um, two potatoes. I don't know why they're not still harvesting potatoes. I guess they're focused on carrots, which is fine. We will eventually need to add beavers here. There we go. There we go. Okay, another night. Another dream. But always beavers. Go to bed. What is he doing? Don't know. They come out to play, they will go straight to work, harvesting at carrots, and we are getting close to getting more trees. I do want, let's just, just do this. What are we waiting for? It's only two logs, but it's two logs that we didn't have before. No, oh, he's coming to build it, so there's no reason to put that there. Absolutely perfect. This guy's got nothing to do again. He can he can stay having nothing to do for now. Maybe grill is not the way to go. We just need to get this stuff done over here, which is going to take planks, which we can't do. Where were they going to bring? Yeah, I know. There's literally nothing for you to do again. So. But they could build this pretty fast. But they, of course, they put it in the platform instead of the floodgate. And there goes our last log. Oh, you missed a spot, bud. Right over here. That should be oak. Okay, is that that should be it with our trees. Hopefully we do not see a bad water event because we are not prepared at all. Maybe we have enough water to get through it, but then again, maybe not. You know? 
So we shall see. In the meantime, though, it is cycle two, day six. It's going to be a little bit slower of a series just because of the fast forwarding issue that I have on my PC. But believe me, it's going to be better. I will see you next time. Goodbye.